Okay, so now we're on our second thing, our second segment. Okay, I'm gonna tell you guys, we're gonna fight in this thing. Okay, guys, so we're gonna be ranking Walt Disney Animation Studio films. This is supposed to come until 2021. We have S, A, B, C, D, F, and Haven. Obviously, S is like the best movie you've ever seen in your life. F is the worst movie you've ever seen, and then haven't seen is we just never seen. The okay, movie. but what does S stand for? Because I know A, B, C, D, and F like like su- the, like superior. Like this is like the one Moana, movie that you Moana have to is see. the first one in the list. <laughs> okay, so the you. first movie is I've never heard of this one. It's it's it looks like it's called the animation. The, oh no, the Adventures of something Ichibod probably and Mr. Toad. Never seen it. I've never no seen it. So I want to put it. I haven't seen <laughs> I have no idea. Which what the hell is that? The next movie is Cinderella. Is that the first one? Yeah, right? Yeah. We're going in like this. So Cinderella, the first one. It looks like it. Yeah, it's the first one. No, because the third one, we would put it as a freaking <laughs> no, F. The no, this is the, f- one? this is the first one. Cinderella. I, um, I don't think it's S. No, it's not S. It's, I don't think it's one of those super princess yeah. movies. They're like, oh my god, I would watch it again 300 times. I think I would do this B. Like, I'm not Me, gonna I was say thinking C. that. <laughs> yeah, I'm not going to say C to not be brave. <laughs> but... I don't know. It's not I, my favorite. Yeah, the story's good, but it's like I wouldn't keep watching it over and over again. Next one um, is Alice in Wonderland. Is it weird that I prefer the live action? Yes. <laughs> I like the animation better. I think that I don't know why Alice in Wonderland the animation is so long for me. I cannot get through the movie. Like it's too long. It takes too long to end, and I'm just like, please. Stop it. I cannot go through this. No, it's C. Like, I'm saying, like, bad between the animations I've seen. It's C. I would not give it an A. Okay, so I'll level out to B. I give it an A. I like it. I like the animation. I like everybody. Tweedledum, Tweedledee. They look like eggs. I like the Cheshire Cat. Next is Peter Pan. I really like that movie. I'm sorry. (laughs) That movie is great. That's one of the movies that I don't really enjoy the live action as much as I thought. I'm so weird. You didn't like the but, live action Peter Pan? No, I liked it. I liked it, but the guy, like Peter Pan, was so mean. I don't know why. I thought he was so mean. <laughs> I had a crush on the actor. I thought he was hot. Anyways, that's besides the point. I don't really I, like Peter Pan, though. I'm going to be honest. I like Tinkerbell. Really? We're gonna put everything in D. <laughs> I give. Oh, I'm gonna give it. I'm gonna give it like a C or a D. I don't like Peter Pan really. I don't know. You can put it as a C. It's not one of like my yeah. favorites. I. I don't know. Live action is better. I prefer the live action though. Next is Lady and the Tramp. I. I hear it different about this movie. Mm-hmm. It's not something like everyone's like. Oh my god! It's amazing, guys. There's nothing amazing about the movie. Like, <laughs> yeah, I think what weirds me out is that it's animals that are like talking. Like it's weird to me. Those are that's all. Yeah, all of the all of the movies where animals talk, even Lion King, is weird to me. Like, what is that? No, I think it's just that Lady and the Tramp is not one of those movies that are like, oh my god, it's remarkable. Like it's a Disney classic. It's just the only scene that is great is a pasta. That's what I was gonna say. I literally was gonna say that. That was the scene that carried the movie. Is the spaghetti kiss no, let's put it as d because peter Pan's still better sleeping beauty listen i am creeped out by that movie now listen though i know <laughs> you i saw you I love like you. come on now and that this song is great <laughs> but let me tell you i am i do not like uh maleficent well i think i like the story i actually really like the story of sleeping beauty and Prince Charming and like the prince fighting the dragon. I like it. For me, Sleeping Beauty is just like Cinderella. It's, it's not like, wow, the best Disney princess wow. movie there is. I think it's better than Cinderella though. I mean, you could put it in front of Cinderella because for me it's indifferent. It's the same thing. Okay, we'll put it in B. We'll put it in front of Cinderella. Okay, 101 Dalmatian. I like the movie. Cruella the movie. I was gonna say, Cruella. I just recently saw Cru- Cruella's movie. It was really good. No, that movie is a masterpiece. I'm telling you, there's some live actions that they came to ruin, to like to ruin everything, and there's some that they just came to make it better. And I don't know what happens in the Disney studios if they have like arguments or some people make some live live actions and others don't participate. Compared so. to the other movies, though, 101 Dalmatians, it's in the back of my head. It's not like the one of the first movies I'd like be like, oh, we have to watch it. I think it's either a C or a D. For me, it's better than Alice in Wonderland. So. 
we'll, we'll put we it in front. Of the scene. Yeah, we'll put it in front of Peter Pan, but okay, this movie, the Sword and Can't... the Stone. I cannot have an opinion about this movie. I feel like it's one of those movies that I only watch once. Like the whole Disney, I don't even think I watched line it. Is the only one that I only watch once. And and a lot of people are like, oh my god, it's so amazing and it's the best movie ever. It's I don't even know. Like it, for me, it's so boring. I I would put it with Lady and the Tramp. Okay. Because it's. I'll take your word on it. Is it like better than Lady and the Tramp or worse than Lady and the Tramp? No, it's worse. The Jungle Book. <laughs> I like yeah, that. That's a classic. Movie. That is a classic movie. Hey, I wouldn't. I wouldn't even be mad if I put it in an S because it was such a good movie. Aristocrat, uh, Aristocats. What do we? What would we put it? I would put it as an A. I love that movie. I really think it's cute and it's amazing. It's the thing that is remarkable is Marie. Like so, it's like there's always this movie that's like something remarkable about it. But I like it because it talks about, basically talks about like the different social classes, like rich and poor, you know, because of the cat they meet. Snow yeah. White. Listen. It's better than Cinderella and Sleeping Beauty. Listen, I might give, this is either A or S right here. She is like one of the first Disney princesses and she like set the bar pretty high. Okay, the next one is Robin Hood. Stools to the rich and gifts to the poor. I feel like it's a B movie, like it's, mm, it's better than Peter Pan in a way because it's funny. It's a movie that is funny. Mm -hmm. Like it's, it's nice, but there's not, there's also nothing remarkable. Like when you think about it, you think about the story of Robin Hood, but not because of Disney. Yeah, I don't know if that makes sense. <laughs> it's just because like, like oh, I know a... who Robin Hood is. Yeah. But the movie of Disney is the last thing to come to my mind. Yeah. Like I don't even think about that. So you'd be a C or a D. I was gonna I say know. C or a D. We need the poo. Ah, uh, yeah. I was gonna say A. It's, it's iconic. The next one is The Rescuers. I've never seen this one. Never seen it. Okay, this one, the Hound and the Fox. Don't even. I cried. Yeah. Oh <laughs> my God! Don't even. The friendship. That was a classic. <laughs> I loved it. It was amazing. I'm putting it in S. I'm kind of creeped out that I don't know the next two movies. <laughs> uh, the plat, the Black Cauldron. I don't know that one. And the Great Mouse Detective. Don't know it either. <laughs> Oliver and Company. I've seen it. It's I better haven't. than Lady and the Tramp. And it's better than Robin Hood. It's cool, like it's a cool story, but it's like you can see that the animation style is very like old, mm -hmm. like back, very back in the day. Oh, choo, choo, I'm choo, sorry, guys. A little more Are you kidding me? Haven't seen it. Are you kidding me? This movie is my favorite Disney movie of all time. Ever since I was a she child. Talks about her. It oh is God. The Little Mermaid. I. Love I don't know why. There's just something about the movie that I love that I as soon as I saw it, like my eyes went wide and I was like, whoa. I think the Little Mermaid, if you put it next to Cinderella, is Snow White and Sleeping Beauty, which were the classics founding um Beauty and the Beast was like the five classics of Disney of Disney. I think the Little Mermaid was the one that had most colors and things like that that like caught people attention. The music Probably. and all that, you know? Mm -hmm. Like barely the music were dramatic. Under the Sea was literally remarkable. It was like a very fun movie. I think that's what it was. It was just like very fun. Yeah. I think all the other princes, they were like, oh, you know, there was a lost my shoe, ate an yeah. apple and all that. And she had something like, I'm running, I want this and I'm going after it. Yeah. I think that's it was what different. it was. That's a, that's a good way to put it. She was like determined to get to the surface, you know, to get legs, to be a human. I think that's what I liked was her determination. The rescuers down under. Never seen the rescuer. She sees us down under. Oh my God. Beauty and the Beast. Beauty and the Beast. Tale as old as time. I'm so sorry, guys. Come on now. Yeah, I mean, there is the, the Stockholm Syndrome, but like, guys, I'm sorry. It's don't her choice, you know, like, The Little Mermaid and Beauty and the Beast, they're just like, they, I don't even know how, like, they have way, they were way better than the other princes. The, way, the other princes were like, kind of like, oh my God, come after me and I'll wait for you. Also, I think what really takes the cake is the music in Beauty and the Beast. It's so like fun and it's like, you can yeah. get up and dance to it. Pinocchio. Pinocchio. Pinocchio makes me depressed. Yeah, like when he goes to the attraction, whatever the shit that he goes, everything goes down so bad. It's not like, oh, he got trapped by that man. No, he got trapped, he got swollen, swollen <laughs> like literally a fucking whale swallowed him. And you just hear like, and then he, all of a sudden you think he died and then he becomes a boy. And I'm just, you're like, guys, no. It's not one of those movies that make me happy. I think what I like about it is there's no love interest. It's about like a dad and his son. 
like that, like a family relationship. But yeah, I don't, I don't know. It's not one of those movies I'm like, oh, I think about Disney and happiness. I'm like, Pinocchio. Maybe like B or C? C. Oh my god, Aladdin. For me, it's, a, it's an A. It's not a super. It's A, but it's not super. I agree. I'll put it A. I like the music too in this one. The Lion King. I don't know. People say like, oh, it's incredible as a masterpiece, but I wouldn't put it as super. Me either. Or I was gonna say A or B. I'll put it as A, as respect, because, <laughs> because it's a classic. Pocahontas. I think people are gonna cancel me after, but I don't like Pocahontas. You don't Pocahontas. like Colors of the Wind? No, like the song is good, but the actual, the actual movie pissed me the fuck off because this man laughed in the end, and I was just like, what the hell is going on? Like, it was the first princess movie that broke me because I was like, they were supposed to end together. We don't, I we think, don't need to yeah, play. I think that that's used to like be so weird is that Disney takes actual like historical things that happen and then try to make it all kiddish. It's kind of weird. Okay, we'll put it a high D because the music does slap though. The Hunchback of Notre Dame. A or B? I, I also cry. It's one of those movies that traumatize me. Like, people just start talking about bullying. I was like, no. I think it's a B. Hercules. <laughs> Again, one of those classics that I'm just all like, oh my god, the best movie in the world. It's just Hercules. Yeah, so I, like, I, yeah, I agree. I'm not a big fan of Hercules. I'm gonna be honest. For me, it's like a D or an F. I don't really like Hercules. Really? For me, I was gonna say B or C, but okay. No, I do not like Hercules. Like, I don't like it. I roll my in school when teachers used to put I used to roll my eyes because I hate Hercules. I think I know it's supposed to be funny, but like even the comedy couldn't help make it better. It was just really bad. It's I I don't know why I it, like I heavily despise it. I don't, it's not even that I don't like it. I despise it. Like I can't stand like I literally can't stand looking at it. I don't know why. Like even looking at it now, so it irritates okay. me very low D because it's so bad. Mulan. <sighs> Oh. on reflection hello talks to my soul <laughs> that song you see mulan is one of those movies i think that's what they were trying to do in aladdin of, of on the live action about girl power oh it yeah she, she's the original in romance at the same time original like, you see that's, that's all you gotta do it's that simple she was like the original girl power in disney and it, it talks about everything it talks about making her family proud it talks about girl power it talks about like her falling in love i, I would put an s it, like it had everything like you said it had every it covered every single part of life next is tarzan let me not talk Why? you don't like it <laughs> i don't like tarzan either <laughs> I I actually despise it as much as Hercules. No, it's hard. It's is a B. It's not like A or super, but it's B. What is wrong with you? I give it like a D or an F too. I don't like it. I give the it second a movie sucks, but the first no. one is amazing. No, I'm so I just cannot. It's it's that movie too where if I watch it, I get irritated. I cannot sit there and watch it. It pisses me off. Fantasia 2000. Never watched it. Me either. Dinosaur. <laughs> The fuck is that? Eh, honestly, you never watched Dinosaur? No. It's a, it's all right. You know what? I'm gonna be honest. <coughs> I probably give Dinosaur an F. It's not. <laughs> it's like, it's not really that great. I, I don't really like it. I, then again, I'm not a huge dinosaur person, so there's probably that too. No idea. Oh my god, the next one, the Emperor's New Groove. If you don't like a. that, a. And I mean, there's, there's a lot of things like they're remarkable, and I'm really mad that Disney still hasn't fucking made a ride out of it. You pull the lever. <laughs> yeah, like literally, <laughs> that's literally the best ride in the whole fucking world. That you guys should just use it. But no, you put Snow White to scare kids, right? Okay. Fantasia, but this is Mickey. Never. You ever watched it? It's a classic. No. I mean, there's the. I think the only iconic thing is a do 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 on the Fantasia is it Fantasia the the fireworks there's another name but fireworks at Hollywood Studios that's the only reason why I know it and there is the head there's another thing you see it Disney I need to talk to you like we need to sit down and speak I think I'm gonna get out taking off the hat from the Hollywood Studios I give it a B it's okay it's okay it's just a classic it's not really like wow Atlantis Mm, I don't remember much about this movie. I think I only watched it like once. Wait, let me I see if I remember. remember. I think I. I also think I probably watched it like one or two times. It's all right. It's not like the greatest. I put it thing. as heaven scene because we don't remember. 
All right, I'll put a habit team. Lilo and Stitch. Hey. She has, the, she has the sassiness. A or C? No, A or, or S. Oh, I was gonna say. <laughs> I don't. I wouldn't be mad putting her on S because it actually is like a very good movie that's like very memorable. Like her sassiness, her oh, fighting God. the little girl. Yeah, no, she's like, iconic. <laughs> when she says <laughs> the whole scene where she bites her and everything. She's yes. Like, hey, <laughs> shut up, bitch. The fuck. I think it was the first time I went and just lapped someone in the screen. I'm like, come here, come real close. <laughs> like, and I like the cartoon. There was a cartoon of it. Oh my god, yes, <laughs> yes, there was. <laughs> I never watched the second movie, but the cartoon was cool. <clears throat> Next one is Treasure Planet. I watched it recently, and for me, it's a C. It's like, it's good, but it's not amazing. It's one of those stories that is, for me, is like, um, it's like Peter Pan. It's remarkable, it's nice and all, but it's also like, wow, it's not Jungle Book or something like that. Brother Bear. I actually like Brother Bear. No, Brother Bear is cool. I liked Brother. it a lot. Yeah, me too. Cold out. I put it like an A. Yeah, I, I liked it. I think at first it was really weird to watch, but then after a while, like it kind of warmed up to you. And I actually really started liking it. Brother Bear is one of those movies that you're not gonna like it as a child. Yeah, then, for sure. When you start like, Thinking about it or re-watching, it get, it's it's amazing. Home on the ranch, or on the Yo, ranch. That movie is so funny. In my childhood, it was it was remarkable. It's a B for me, but like today, I don't feel like people talk as much about it as they should. Chicken oh, Little. No. I'm so I'm so sorry if you don't like Chicken Little. This is a problem. Okay. No. The sky is falling. The sky is falling. I laughed so hard for Chicken Little for no motherfucking reason. The freaking big. <laughs> I was literally <laughs> dying as a child, and I was just there like, okay, like no one is laughing with me, but I am. And, and then the like goose. the whole romance there was between the chicken and the freaking duck. And, I was like, <laughs> and the next one's Meet the Robinsons. I love that movie. I love it. A lot of people don't like it. I love it. Mm, yeah, I'm part of those people. It was, mm, it was all right. I really liked that movie. I, I think it was well, just uh, it was a cool movie because I think it was like futuristic, but like I didn't watch it again. I think I only watched it once, and I was like, yeah. No, I, watch, I think it's because as a child, I don't know if it's because I was slow as fuck, but as a child, um, I never saw the ending coming. And I was just there like, excuse me, this is mind blowing. It's not only the end that happened with the, the guy, like the main character, but the villain. I did not see his, like he, that he was the child, the, the friend. Yeah. The <laughs> I was like, excuse, I think it was the, like my first plot was when like when i was young and i was like mind-blowing was, like this is it guys so i really like that movie i rewatched it like 300 times the next one is bolt bolt i i it was one of those movies that i was obsessed as a child i like watched but when today i wouldn't watch yeah me either <laughs> i feel like i was like oh my god bolt You're like it's so cool but today i don't feel the same way about it it was very good for me as a child like i rewatch it but i think i got tired of it of how much i rewatched it okay this one princess and the frog amazing super incredible yes. i love princess and the frog are you kidding me the music okay one thing that people do not talk about in this movie is the fucking blonde girl she was the best yes. friend i've ever seen in the whole disney universe like the ending where she's just like, oh, it's fine if you guys fell in love. Like no other bitch would do that. Yes, I agree. Tangle. Tangle. Super. Please. Amazing. Okay, guys, if you didn't cry during the boat scene, I'm telling you. But I think also Tangle, like right after Prince and the Frog, was the first movie that had the shift in animation that it was 3D. Yeah. And and, and at least in the princess's line, and I was like, wait. That's different. What the fuck is happening here? And I loved it. I loved it every freaking aspect out, out of it. Was They're it, very the detailed. Fuck? This is a Rapunzel. I need it. Dumbo. I I don't like Dumbo, guys. I'm sorry. Me <laughs> I was gonna. I was like waiting for you to see what you're gonna say. I don't like Dumbo. I cannot like Dumbo. And the the live action was cute, but it's still not it. And I don't like Dumbo. Talking. I just. Me fucking animals i think he's cute he would be like a in the cuteness but fucking f in the yeah <laughs> I, I, okay Ooh, i was gonna say drf but you know what evan <laughs> wreck it ralph didn't watch it i love the movie love it 
it's so good. The second movie is one of those few movies in Disney that the second movie was actually good, just because they put the princesses and there were so many references. They even put fucking Stan Lee on the second movie. And I was like, this is incredible. But I really liked the first one. The first one, it made me cry, it made me laugh, it made me be happy, and it was just everything. They gave Pac-Man on this thing. So it's A, put A. Can I believe you've never seen it? I'm very yeah, hurt. No. But I have seen Frozen. Let it go. I like the first one better than the second one. Me too. I like the second one. I'm not going to say the second one was terrible. It was not horrible at all. I don't know if it's super, but it's A for, for sure. I'll put it A. I don't think it's super either. Big Hero 6. Oh, super. Excuse me, guys. I cried when the older brother died. I was, like, sobbing. And then I saw when he saw the, the video that he left for him, Topia. Never watched it. I know. Girl, what is wrong with you? I don't like talking animals. <laughs> nah, but Zootopia is one of the talking animals that it's good. And fucking, the, the way that they did the slot, if you, have you seen this slot scene at least? No. Girl, just put it as A. Moana, make way, make way. Moana, if you don't put that as super, we're literally <laughs> fighting and I'm leaving. Because, guys, Moana, it's everything to me. Everything. She's not a princess, right? People say she's not a princess because she's the daughter. She, she's saying that on the movie. Mm -hmm. But it was the first princess movie that there was no romance at all. Like, there That's was true. a guy, but there was no love story. And she was just fucking iconic. And the musics were great. She's and an independent woman. It was Wreck It Ralph breaks the internet. It's a. B like it's it's great. I told you it's great because of the references. I don't think if it was because of the reference, uh, it would be great. And it's not like they just got someone from an arcade and threw it on the internet. There was a story, you know. I thought Disney was gonna ruin it because of that. Mm -hmm. It was great. Frozen the first one. Two. I feel like Frozen Two Olaf carried the whole movie. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Literally, Olaf just put the movie in his back and he like, let's go, guys. I got you. Because the story, even though Into the Unknown it was a great song, I try. I think they try to make it the next Let It Go, yeah. but they didn't pick it up. Um, it's just the story was very weird, and I don't understand how water has memories. I think they just threw out the whole plot. No, yeah. Didn't have to the spirit. <laughs> I, I think they just. I don't know. I think they just wanted to do a second movie just to do it, and like it just didn't work out. I give it a C. Okay, Raya. Raya. Um, I, I, I cried. didn't like Raya. <laughs> I cried a lot though. They try to make girl power, but then they put a girl against a girl, and I was just standing there like, what is the whole point? But I think the problem was how fast paced it was. Like you jump yeah. from one scene to another, and I'm just there like, whoa, let's slow down, guys. And she found her in a second. I was there like, yeah, um, that that's the problem. I thought I thought the whole plot was gonna be her going on a journey to find the dragon. Yeah, that I think everyone went to it with that expectation, like, oh, guys, we're going into this, and it's gonna be about you know finding her. I, I think the the plot would be better if okay, Raya's whole plot is she has like these clues to go find the dragon. It's like a C or D. I don't. Raya's not one of the I think plot wise, it's definitely a D. Next one's Encanto. Encanto! Du, du, du. And, bro, okay. This movie is something that pisses me the fuck off for the simple fact that the music, it's amazing. Like, I would literally live up freaking. We don't talk about Bruno. Mm -hmm. The whole. But then the plot was also just. Thrown. <laughs> I think it was just weird. I just did. I don't know. I just didn't really vibe with the plot. The music was really good. Like it was, ooh, but it was just the plot. I don't know what it was. It just didn't stick with me. I. It just. I don't know. It's because there wasn't really a plot. We are used to watching something where there's villains, and yeah. there is. You see what I'm saying? There's always a villain. There's always something that the world is going to end. The sky is falling. And now Disney is just doing everything about a caring and accepting, which is great. I understand because now that's what the world needs but they're also like for uh i think for children nowadays is okay like you're obsessed with it but for us we've been watching disney since we were very young like from the early 2000s we're not seeing the plots anymore bambi you're up next fucking hate it bambi gives me depression just like fucking dumbo and pinocchio like a d or an f yeah 
What would you give? Hmm. Maybe like a C. We'll do D. I think I think Bambi is one of those things that if you think about Disney, you think about Bambi. That's what I'm saying. Like it's kind of like iconic. Yeah, but, like, but I think the character is iconic, not the movie. Because if you ask some children, oh, you like Bambi? Yeah, what is the movie? They don't know. <laughs> yeah. I have no idea what this is. Saludos, amigos. I've never watched that. I've seen it, but I don't remember. Three caballeros. I only the like it because good. they have something that represents Brazil. <laughs> <laughs> the ride's good. I haven't seen this, though. Fun and fancy free. I have never seen the three last <laughs> Me either. All right, the three last are coming here. See everything that we did. Okay, guys, so this is our list. The, so starting from S, we have Snow White, Fox and the Hound, The Little Mermaid, Beauty and the Beast, Mulan, Lilo and Stitch, Chicken Little, Princess and the Frog, Tangled, Big Hero 6, and Moana. These are the movies that we think slap and carry this whole generation. Next, we have A. These are, they're good, but they're not like, wow. But they're not like bad. They're just, yeah. they're really good. We have The Jungle Book, Aristoc Aristocats, Winnie the Pooh, Aladdin, Lion King, The Emperor's New Group, Brother Bear, Meet the Robinsons, Winnie the Pooh, Wreck-It Ralph, Frozen, <laughs> and Zootopia. V is, these are the movies that we think is good good, but they could, they, they lack in some things and they could be better, but they're, they're pretty good. So we have uh, The Hunchback of Notre Dame, Sleeping Beauty, Cinderella, Alice in Wonderland, Tarzan, Fantasia, Home on the Range, and Wreck-It Ralph Breaks the Internet. C is these movies are okay. They're all right. I would watch them like a few times, but I wouldn't go out of my way to watch them. So we have 101 Dalmatians, Peter Pan, Oliver and Company, Robin Hood, Pinocchio, Treasure Planet, Bolt, and Frozen 2. Frozen 2 could go lower though. Yeah, I was I was literally <laughs> about to say that. I think <laughs> Frozen, Frozen 2 could go lower. <laughs> doesn't feel with the C. I was like, mm. Okay, D is these movies just are lacking. Are lacking and Disney did not put enough time and effort to try to make these movies better. Someone just said, yeah, okay, and just put it out there, but it should have never been put, put out there. Pocahontas, Lady and the Tramp, The Sword and Stone, Hercules, Raya and the Last Dragon, and Kanto and Bambi. Bambi could go lower, but I'm just like... <laughs> F! These are the movies that are terrible. They're disgusting i don't know why they even exist we it just doesn't make any sense they just put them out for money we have dinosaur dumbo frozen 2 and bambi and then our last list we have haven't seen because we just never saw it i, I don't even I, I didn't even know these existed that's what this is didn't know it existed ichi i think that the whole thing is ichibod and mr toad the rescuers the black cauldron what a dumb name the great mouse detective melody time the Rescuer Down Under, Fantasia 2000, Atlantis, uh, Saludos Amigos. What, what the fuck is that anyways? The Three Caballeros, Fun and Fancy Free, and then Make Mine Music. All right, well, this is our tier list for Disney.